all right hello everyone we are going to get started with jumping jacks before we go into our stretches one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty now we're gonna get ready for straight jumps one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Very good. And now tuck jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. And now standing straddle. Go to your left and hold that. Make sure your toes are facing the front. And now go to your right. And now reach towards the middle. Try to push your elbows towards the ground. And now reach through. And arms up. And down. Really reach for your toes and keep your legs straight. And now sitting straddle, you're gonna put your right arm up, your left arm in front and go towards your left side. And now you're gonna put your left arm up, right arm in front and go to your right side. And now both arms up, you're going to turn your chest to the left and you're either going to put your chest to your knee or your nose to your knee. Reaching for that foot, keeping those toes pointed, laces face the, facing the sky. And now the other way, chest to your right, lean down, chest to your knee or nose to your knee. And now reach towards the middle, keeping those toes pointed. And now feet together, toes pointed, legs straight, and reach as far as you can, keeping your legs straight and your toes pointed. Now reach for your toes, pull your heels off the ground, and now into butterfly, where are you flying to? I would really like to be in Disney World right now. And now push out your feet and nose to your feet. And now get ready to go into your right leg lunge, making sure your knee does not go over your ankle. Make sure it's right on top. And now straighten that front leg, pointing that toe, nose to your knee. And split. And we're now gonna hold this for a full minute. And now go ahead and get on your left leg lunge. Again, knee is directly on top of that ankle. Lace is down on your back leg, straighten that front leg, nose to your knee, and go ahead and go into that split, holding it for a full minute. Make sure your back lace is on the ground and your front leg, your toe is pointed.
All right, now you are going to stay in your split, but take both your hands, place them in the middle, lift up your hips, turn your kneecaps and your laces towards the front, and you're gonna hold that. And then you're gonna lift your hips back up, turn your hips towards the opposite direction, your back kneecap should be down, and your front kneecap should be up, and you are going to hold that. All right, now you're gonna get ready for your bridge. You are going to push up, try to get your legs straight as can be, your wrist directly underneath your shoulders, and hold that. And come down and rock it out one, two, three and if you can do a standing back bend you can look at those fingertips push those hips forward and go back hold that really try to walk your feet and your hands close and kick over and once again hips forward and as you are kicking over push that chest towards the back wall and now for a drill you're going to get on your knees and you are going to put your feet together, your knees apart, push your hips forward, look at your fingertips, go back and go into a bridge and come up or go down. One more time. And there you go. All right, now get on either a block or a couch or a stable chair or a bed. And parents, this is where you can help. You can help them get back into a back bend, have them push up, get their shoulders directly over their wrist, pushing behind their chest towards the back wall, making sure their chest is pushing over them and help them kick over if they need it and have them end in a lunge and try to get those legs straight as possible. And end in a lunge. And now if you can unfold it, you are free to. If not, you can go onto a flatter surface or continue on the chair. And once again, push their chest, have them kick over and end in a lunge. And you're gonna wanna continue to do this until they practically have it by themselves. And then you can move to the floor. As they're back bending, make sure their hands are next to their ears. They look at their fingertips, they push their hips forward and they go back. And as they're kicking over, have them have straight legs and end in a lunge. And once again, and if their shoulders are not directly over their wrist, have them walk their feet closer to their hands to help them kick over and have them end in that lunge once again. And now we're gonna get ready for jump drills. So go ahead and get into a sitting straddle with your toes pointed and your laces facing the ceiling. You're gonna put one hand on each side of one leg and you're gonna do 10 circles towards the back wall. And now go to the other leg and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And now we're gonna do the middle. So you're gonna make sure your chest is up, your hands are on the back side of your body. Do not lean back. Lean forward if anything, and one, two, three, four, five, and take a break, and five more, five, four, three, two, one, very good. And now get ready to do your jump kicks. Making sure your arms are in a low V, not a T, not a high V, in a low V, and one, two straight legs, three pointed toes, four, five keeping that chest up and stationary not don't do not lean forward and keep those arms down six and now one two three four five and you're good and now get ready to do three toe touches with me one two three four five drum six seven eight Two more. One, two, three, four, five up six, seven, eight. One more. One, two, three, four, five up six, seven, eight. And now into pikes. One, two, 
three, four, five up six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five up six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five up six, seven, eight. Very good. I will see y'all at practice this week.